Today on Live at 4, Milwaukee City leaders sending a message loud and clear about the police department's pursuit policy. This just this morning, Greenfield police were involved in a chase that ended in Milwaukee. A traffic stop in Greenfield led to the chase. Greenfield officers say they ended the pursuit when speeds got dangerous. One dispatch over to turn eight. He is pretty far ahead. He's going about 115, approaching 20th. I'm going to terminate and then just check, make sure it didn't crash. Ten work, turn that was good. That driver did crash. He died when he collided with a semi. That chase did not involve Milwaukee police, but city leaders want to make sure everybody in the city knows when officers will now chase a suspect. Kareen Zell has more on what the police say and the citywide effort to spread the word. The police chief wants to be clear on this. The person who drives off during the chase will be held responsible, not the officers. Before the policy change, police could only chase after drivers suspected of committing a violent felony. That changed back in the fall, allowing officers to chase after reckless drivers and drug dealers. City leaders are reiterating the policy today, reminding drivers it's a felony if you drive off when people pull you over. Police department's obligation is uh, the, the safety of the public. So we can't go on ignoring this behavior. We have to do something about it. Officials plan to start a citywide campaign educating the community about the pursuit policy. They'll target young people by using social media. Reporting downtown at City Hall, Corinne Zell, today's TMJ4.